The new fitness court at Rotary Park in Sioux Falls is ready for anyone looking for a free workout while outside. The city of Sioux Falls Parks and Recreation is also hosting events designed to help you to understand how to use the equipment. Kelloland's Lauren Solick takes us there now. With 28 different fitness stations, this court offers the chance for a full body workout from cardio to weightlifting. The excitement is that it's first of kind in the city and even our state. Uh, to have a fitness court offering is it adds to our array of experiences we're providing to the community. Now, if you're unsure how to use the equipment, Sioux Falls Parks and Recreation is offering classes throughout the summer so you can learn how to properly use it all. So whether it's a Move It Monday, a Workout Wednesday, or Fitness Friday for you, you can come enjoy free fitness equipment. Now, if you can't make it to one of the informational classes, there are pictures depicting how to use all of the equipment here at the fitness court with stars labeling the difficulty of each exercise. I'm going to stick with a level one, but you could go up to level three. There's signage that explain how to use all of the equipment as well as QR codes. And the QR codes actually take you to the company's website that provides more instructional information on how to use the equipment as well as giving you workouts. So it gives, it provides 20 minute workouts for an individual to use while they're at the fitness court. A chance to get moving no matter your experience level. It's right on the trail. It's got a great location. It's available to all. Um, get out, get exercise, get fresh air. In Sioux Falls, Lauren Solick, Kelloland News. I want to go. I think I might want to try that. Yeah, me too. Well, Parks and Rec staff say that the equipment is designed for people 13 and older, which is also stated on the signage around the fitness court. Their next instructional class will be Friday, July 27th. From noon to 2, we've listed all class times under this story on kelloland.com.